July 30th, 2023, Daily Bread. Passage, Luke chapter 14, verses 25 through 35. Key verse 27, title, Who Can Be Jesus' Disciple? Large crowds were traveling with Jesus, and turning to them, he said, If anyone comes to me and does not hate father and mother, wife and children, brothers and sisters, yes, even their own life, such a person cannot be my disciple. And whoever does not carry their cross and follow me cannot be my disciple. Suppose one of you wants to build a tower. Won't you first sit down and estimate the cost to see if you have enough money to complete it? For if you lay the foundation and are not able to finish it, everyone who sees it will ridicule you, saying, This person began to build and wasn't able to finish. Or suppose a king is about to go to war against another king. Won't he first sit down and consider whether he is able with 10,000 men to oppose the one coming against him with 20,000? If he is not able, he will send a delegation while the other is still a long way off and will ask for terms of peace. In the same way, those of you who do not give up everything you have cannot be my disciples. Salt is good, but if it loses its saltiness, how can it be made salty again? It is fit neither for the soil nor for the manure pile. It is thrown out. Whoever has ears to hear, let them hear. Daily Bread Message Large crowds traveled with Jesus, but how many were his disciples? Turning to address his crowd, Jesus lays out three statements regarding those who cannot be his disciples. This is an invitation we need to wrestle with in our own relationship with Jesus. Let's look at each one. Jesus says anyone who comes to him and does not hate their family, even their own life, cannot be his disciples. Hate here is to be taken in comparison. We are to love our family and love others as ourselves, but Jesus is to be first, far above all. This does not produce loss, but rather gain in terms of our relationships. Jesus says whoever does not carry their cross and follow him cannot be his disciple. Jesus wants no fair-weather friends. As Bonhoeffer wrote, when Christ calls a man, he bids him come and die. Jesus says those of us who do not give up all we have cannot be his disciple. This is in the context of counting the cost. While a builder will need to calculate the cost of construction and a king the cost of war, to be Jesus' disciple will cost our whole being. This is what it means to love God with all our heart and with all our soul and with all our strength and with all our mind. Prayer. Father, I want to follow Jesus. Help me count the cost, take up my cross, and love him first. One word. By faith, we can be Jesus' disciple.